Hi everybody, Fintan here from Dams and Cloud. Are you guys sick of video calls? If you are, you should probably turn this video off. So this week I wanted to cover Google Meet. Google Meet is Google's enterprise video conferencing solution and I've done some demonstrations of some of the features before but I wanted to talk about some new updates that Google are bringing to the product. Uh, there are four new features that, are, that they are launching and really the feature launches and we're definitely going to be seeing more of these um, across all of the different companies in the video conferencing space is, to, is because they're all competing with each other. Um, we're all working from home now, people are remote working a lot um, and people are you know, jumping on video calls, not just to connect with colleagues, but also to connect with friends and family as well. And so video conferencing has become a huge part of, of everybody's lives now. And I think um, it's actually really valuable for the consumer, for the, for the end users, for businesses and consumers, because all of these companies, Zoom and Microsoft Teams and Google, all competing with each other is only going to lead to improvements in the product. Now, the four features that Google have released this week, and as I said, I think this is gonna probably become a common thing where there's gonna be new features every few weeks or a few months. Um, the first one is Tiled View. Now, Tiled View, um, or as some people are, are dubbing it, the Brady Bunch View, is when more than four people are in a call, um, the, the other people, the more than four, five or six or seven, aren't knocked off your view. So before it used to just give you the, the four person view. Now you can have six or seven or eight or nine people in a call. It's up to 16 at the moment and there's plans to expand that. So I think with all of us working remotely before people used to kind of connect in maybe from an office with three or four people and then maybe four or five people in another office and then one or two connecting in from home. The number of connections was probably a lot less. Now we're all in our own little bubbles and so um, I think having this ability to see everybody on a call is much more important. The next feature is low light mode. So Google are using their AI technology to check out the background and the person's face and, and use that uh, to adjust the settings automatically so that you can be seen on camera. Running it mobile at the moment and then it's also going to be available on the web as well. The third one is noise cancellation. So again, the AI technology is being used to reduce uh, the noise from keyboard clicks and from dogs barking and things like that. And um, this is only gonna be available in enterprise, but currently everybody has enterprise features. So um, you should see that rolling out soon as well. And then the fourth one seems like not much of a big deal, but I actually think it's a really interesting feature. It's the ability to actually uh, present a Chrome tab within, um, within a Google Meet. And what this means is that instead of just presenting your whole desktop or, or um, presenting maybe a, 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 a particular screen, you can actually pr present a specific Chrome tab. And that means Google will stream the audio and video from that tab. So it can be very valuable if you want to show a video in a Google Meet. And certainly myself, um, having done remote presentations and training, being able to do that would be extremely valuable. So I think for a lot of companies now where everybody is stuck at home, it would be useful to be able to do that in a lot of scenarios. So a very, very interesting one uh, from Google there. Before I finish, I wanted to remind people that the features for G Suite Enterprise uh, for Google Meet are being extended until um, sorry September 30th for all G Suite customers. So um, all the Google Meet Enterprise features being extended there again. And also Google are offering for non-G Suite customers Google Meet Enterprise for free until September 30th. So it's a fantastic offer. Uh, and we have some details on our website about that. So if it's um, something that you're interested in or your organization is struggling with collaborating remotely and video conferencing uh, and some of the features within Google Meet are, are of interest to you, jumping on a video call easily without having to install anything, being able to record or broadcast and stream your, your uh, video calls, um, then do check out the details on our website uh, and get in contact with us. Thanks very much for listening and I will see you guys next week.